Um, yeah. I wanted to talk about Eric Buell and his oh, two. Oh shit, you do that. I, I um, yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. You eat, man. You eat. You've been you've been talking for thirty minutes. So guys, I want to talk real quick about. I'm gonna sit over here like this. I want to talk about Eric Buell. Uh, something just came out. He unveiled two lightweight e vehicles with his new urban mobility brand, Fuel. <laughs> F U E L L. It it's it's Buell but with an F. Um, so what he did is he created two bikes. Um, it's called <laughs> it's catchy. <laughs> uh, it's called Flow. <laughs> I bought the bike called Flow. Uh, the Fuel Flow. Um, it's really hard to read this. I'm reading from a a, a website that it's electricmotorcycles dot news. And they kind of made it sound weird. So an electric motorcycle available in 11 kilowatts, it's a 125cc equivalent, or a 35 kilowatt uh, requires a motorcycle license. I mean, I, it's kind of hard to, to read. I'll, uh, I'll post the link in the description on this one. And it says it combines practical aspects for the urban journey, integrated 50 liter, 13 gallon internal storage. That I don't understand because if it's an electric bike, it shouldn't have 13 gallons of anything. Oh, uh, a st oh, oh, storage. Okay, that finally clicked. Thank you. Fuck this man. Is, <laughs> just, just sit back and, and just talk shit to me. That's all. That's all you're here for now. <laughs> eat, eat and talk shit. Okay. Okay. So, 13 gallons of storage. That's actually a lot. That's a lot yeah. of storage. Um, and then I guess it has a uh, really good low center gravity, but the, uh, the wheel, the, the wheel itself is the motor. So I'm going to go ahead and, oops, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to pop it up on the screen. All right. So one second. So yeah, it's, it's, it's a weird looking bike just because, I mean, look at that thing. I'm going to put it over Matt's head. So nice. that's, that's the bike. Um, it's called the flow and Eric Buell, I, I, I really like his. They named this after the progressive lady, I think. The f flow? <laughs> <laughs> the progressive lady flow. And <laughs> so there's there's that bike, and uh, that it's a, it's a 125cc. I mean, I guess all that is storage, and then that rear wheel has the electric motor in it. So I think that's pretty interesting. That, I mean, they usually don't have, like, a motor in the wheel. It's usually, I mean, the uh, live wires, that big old hunk of crap. Um and it doesn't have anything like that. So I think that's pretty interesting. But uh, so, yeah, they came out with that. We're going to make this a quick topic, but they came out with that. And then right here, let's put that over Matt's face again. Uh, mm -hmm. That is the bicycle that they're coming out. It's called the Fluid. Uh, it's a robust and elegant electric bike with exceptional range up to 125 miles thanks to its two removable batteries. So that's pretty cool. Generous torque, uh, 100 something. I don't know how to read that science crap. Virtually maintenance-free with its carbon belt and internal hub gears. Fluid is offered as a pedelic max 20 miles per hour or S pedelic max 28 miles per hour requiring helmet insurance in most states. So it looks pretty cool. Um, the first bike, the, the actual motorcycle is going to be like 11 grand. The other bike's going to be $3,300, this mountain bike looking thing. So it's pretty cool. 125 city miles for that little bike. I just want to talk about that real quick since uh, that stuff kind of came out. But now we're going to kind of open it up to the chat.